going to show you now how to do one by one ribbing. There are lots of different ribbings. Most often it's two by two, sometimes it's three by three, sometimes it's three by four. You can make any variation, but this is one by one. So I'm going to show you now how to do it. So here we go for the ribbing, one by one. Just going to tie a little loop around the needle and cast on. Remember you have to cast on an even number of stitches so that I'm going to do 16. If you don't know how to cast on, you can watch my video on how to cast on. So here we go. We're going to knit one. We're going to put the yarn in front and purl one. Yarn in back, knit, yarn in front, purl. Going to do that all the way across the row. Continue on, knit, purl, yarn in back, knit, yarn in front, purl the last stitch. Now we're going to turn the work around. We're going to do exactly the same thing. Slipping the first stitch as always, knit wise, yarn in front, purl, yarn in back, knit, yarn in front, purl. And you just keep doing this row after row until you've reached your desired length for ribbing. So there you have it, one by one ribbing, same on both sides, very easy to do. The only way that you can get into trouble is if you don't put an even number of stitches on your cast on. You must start with knit, end with purl. When you turn it over, start with knit, end with purl, otherwise you're going to get seed stitch or some other variation. So that is the way to do the one by one knitting and I hope you'll give it a try. It makes a nice tight, tight edging. And in the meantime, like me, subscribe, comment, all that stuff. And happy knitting everyone!